DChef and in this video I'd like to show you how to select an ingredient from the NPC database. IT Chef contains the NPC database with over 2,500 ingredients. To select an ingredient you scroll through the list and you find the ingredient that most closely represents what you're after. In this instance we're looking for olive oil and we're looking for olive oil that is pure. Here we go, olive oil pure. We put in the supplier. We can put in a brand if we like, the department, the category, which is dry goods, the group, which is oils. Here we have when buying and when using. When we buy our olive oil, we buy it in by the bottle. The cost of the bottle is $21.60. In the bottle, we have 750 mils. We use mils. When we do our nutrition calculation, we need to do it in grams. So here we have the provision, how many grams per mil. In this instance, we're going to say that there's one gram per mil. You can see here the total stock value now. Here we have the actual stock when using, which is the stock on hand as well. We're going to say that we've got 5,000 mils in stock. We know that there's 6.6 .6 bottles and it's a cost of $144. You can see here that the new cost is calculated to allow for that 5,000 mils. Here you can put in a product code, a wastage factor. There's no wastage factor for the olive oil. There's also no tax on olive oil, but if there was a tax, you would check it here and that would calculate the tax when buying. Here for the minimum stock, we're going to say that we need to keep in minimum stock 2,000 mils. And our maximum stock is going to be 10,000 mils. Our networking solutions can automate the ordering, but in this instance, it's just as a guide. Over here we have the shelf life. We like to use our, use our olive oil within seven days of opening and we like the storage temperature to be around 10 degrees. The delivery temperature comes in from the goods received on the iPad or from the received on the computer and the last date delivered is also inserted in from the ordering. We can include a photo and that's how you add an ingredient from the NPC. If you'd like to add an ingredient that's not in the NPC, you simply go to Ingredient List, New Ingredient, you fill out the details of your new ingredient, and if you have custom nutritional values, you can go to Nutritional Details, you then add in the nutritional details, the name of the ingredient, and save the values. Thanks for watching this video, and I'll make more videos shortly.